Hi and happy filming day. So today I have another swimsuit try on haul because what is the most popular video on my channel? It's a swimsuit try on haul. Obviously my audience is very into beach fashion and I respect that. There's no other reason why that video would be popular. So hey, <laughs> we're doing it again. So White Fox Boutique recently had an up to 70% off sale and I got I think pretty much every swimsuit from that sale which is still all available on their site so these were very affordable compared to what they normally are but I just want to go through these swimsuits and share them with you guys hopefully we can all have a beautiful summer outside of our houses for you Americans anyway it's coming into winter here in Australia for us so this is kind of pointless for me but for you guys hopefully this is great anyway this first swimsuit I'm going to start with a bang because this is my favourite thing ever. Like, I love this swimsuit so much, I would very much like to book a tropical holiday and only pack this. Like, I will wear this for a week, I don't care, it's that freaking cute. Anyway, it is this one piece glittery sparkly swimsuit with this very low V cut and then a little dangly star. See, this is great on me because I have no chest, so it's not scandalous, it's just flattering, I want to say, but I know something about the sparkles and the deep cut just makes this the cutest swimsuit in the freaking world. So catch me in Hawaii wearing only this. <laughs> okay, so obsessed with this swimsuit would be an understatement. I think it is so cute. I love the glitter. I think it is super Flat, flattening? Yes, I don't have a chest. Flattering on the body. I don't know how practical it would actually be in the water, like I wouldn't want it to fly open or anything, but again, I don't think it would. It is quite tight, but yeah, I think this is the cutest little swimsuit. Again, it might look a little bit scandalous if you had big boobies, but I don't have to worry about that, so it's just cute. Okay, so the next swimsuit is kind of a set in a way, and it is this plain white, white fox bikini. So the top is your simple little triangle top, you know, super cute, kind of nervous that it's tie up because that seems overly easy to come undone, but I'm going to trust the water with this one and it also comes with matching white fox bottoms which honestly look a bit nervously cheeky which <laughs> I'm not very um, confident in just wearing a bikini bottom which is why I found this set so fascinating so this was actually under festival wear but it matches perfectly as you can see and it is these tiny little booty shorts and in all honesty I would totally wear this in the pool with this top. I would just feel so much more confident with little teeny tiny shorts on rather than just full bikini bottoms but yeah I thought that was a really cool idea. I don't think it's meant for water like I said it was festival wear but <laughs> I'm gonna wear it as bikini bottoms because that's just way more fun. Okay, so this is that little white fox print swimsuit without the shorts. I mean, it's a little ugh, scandalous. I don't know how I feel about it. It's definitely cute, but I would feel more comfortable and confident with the shorts on. So let's add them and see how it completes the look. So here we go, tiny little booty shorts. Festival wear, apparently. Instantly way more confident. High-waisted, covers your belly, covers a bit more down here, covers your butt. Still cute as hell. Okay, so this next piece I'm going to pair with the white top because I didn't get the matching top because it was sold out. Hello, here we go. But I was so intrigued by these bottoms. I thought they were so freaking cute. It is... These white bottoms, but then hello, buckle in ladies and gentlemen, we've got a freaking seatbelt. <laughs> I 
I just really like this design. I thought it was super badass and hoping it looks just as cool on because I don't know, something about it. Super cute. Also, there's, I don't want to talk about the little brown spots. There's a teeny tiny brown spot on here, right? And my dog had like explosive diarrhea in this room Ooh. and all the swimsuits were in here ready to film. And I'm not sure if that's a teeny, 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 tiny speckle of explosive dog diarrhea. I should probably put this in the wash. <laughs> okay, so these bottoms I am absolutely obsessed with. Something about this little buckle, which actually does up and undoes for some reason, but I don't know. I just think it looks so badass. Okay, so this next set is a gorgeous color. I absolutely love yellow. It is my favorite color in the whole world. I love this top, except that it is strapless. I don't really have anything to keep up, but you know. Now, when I got these bottoms, high-waisted yellow bottoms, super cute, I'm like, oh, they look tiny. I don't think my waist is that small, and they are an extra small. I swear I got a small, but that's okay. I don't know if these are gonna fit because your girl is not an extra small. Like, maybe a small, not an extra small. But I mean, they stretch. We can hopefully squeeze into these and see what happens. <laughs> but other than that, the color is just freaking gorgeous. Okay, so this top here is actually quite tight, so I wouldn't be worried about it. For, oh, it might, I don't know. I don't know if it would fall down or not. You'd have to. I guess test that in the water but these bottoms do fit and they're actually not too bad again they're not as tight as I thought they would be and I mean they're quite comfortable I do really like the color I think it's very vibrant and I don't know vacation tropical holiday sort of vibe but is, have I got the I don't do I have this upside down no I don't know I have no idea I don't think it would come down but again I don't really trust strapless that much so. <laughs> so speaking of an extra small, I wanted to chuck another one piece in this haul because I just feel like it's more interesting when there's a mix of two piece and one piece because some people don't like some but they do like other types of swimsuits. So I got this red swimsuit but it was on sale so it was very affordable and it was only available in extra small. Again. I'm not an extra small, but I wanted to try it anyway. If it fits, that's amazing. If it doesn't, check out my Depop. I'll probably pop it up on there, but cute. I really, oh, I want to go to Hawaii or maybe like Byron Bay. Anyway, just somewhere tropical. If only we were allowed to travel. <sighs> okay. Okay, so this one was a bit of a squeeze to get over my hips because again, it's an extra small and I'm definitely not an extra small, but the shape of it is super cute. I feel like this is something that you would take photos in for Instagram, but I wouldn't actually wear on the beach. But you know, super cute. I do like how sort of it sits up on the hips rather than down lower. I think that is a lot more flattering. It is very Baywatch, <laughs> but yeah, the red is really nice and oh, you get a little bit of under boob going. <laughs> nice. I quite like this one. Again, I mean, it would be slightly better if it was a size small instead of an extra small, but I'm honestly just happy that I fit into it. I didn't think that I would for a little bit there. But yeah, it's a little bit cheeky, <laughs> but it's nice. So these last three, three things are technically not swimwear, but I just thought they were so freaking cute. I had to get them and show you. So first is this top. Now I saw this first on White Fox's Instagram and I was like, holy, I love that. And this was the perfect excuse to buy it because it kind of looks like a swimsuit. It's not, but it kind of does. So it is this little crop top with these chains. It's so simple. You could probably DIY this yourself, but something about it, it's just so freaking cute. Would I wear it in the pool? Probably not, but it's nice. <laughs> okay, so this one again is technically a t-shirt, but like it's small enough to be a bikini, let's be real. I feel like this would be perfect for a little beach vacation. My goodness, Cap. Come on in. 
You want to be in the video. This would be perfect for a little beach vacation, like walking around the beach area, but not actually going in the water. What do you reckon, Mel? Do you like it? Yeah, I think she likes it. She's purring. So these last two tops are also festival wear, but again, it can kind of get away with being swimsuits. So first is this little bralette swimsuit festival top and it's lacy on the front and just covered in jingle jangles so very coachella very you're gonna get your shoulders burned but very fun so again technically this one is festival wear but if you were going to the beach and not technically in the water you would probably drive everyone insane because you're jingling and jangling all over the place but I think this is really nice. Again, this would be amazing at a festival, but like, hello, you would get so burned. If I was going to Coachella, <laughs> I would rock this, but I did think it looked like a swimsuit. You might be able to get away with it in the pool, but it might also be a little bit too delicate. <laughs> and this last one is like a little cover-up. Well, I'd hope it would be a cover-up because you don't want to wear this just on its own. It would be very inappropriate, but it is this little diamante cover-up thing. I don't really know how to explain it. You'll see it when it's on. You put it over a black bikini top and it looks really cool. I don't have a black bikini top, so maybe I'll put it over the white one in the try-on. Anyway. Okay, so this one is a little difficult to demonstrate because I just can't really tie it up by myself, I have no idea what I'm doing, but it would be something like that, but over a black swimsuit where you could see all the diamantes, that would be super cute, but again, it's technically festival wear, so I feel like it probably wouldn't hold up in a swimming pool, but I mean, you get the idea, something like that. This is the last one that I tried on in the order. So now I guess we're going to end the video. So thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed it. Hop onto White Fox Boutique as soon as you can if you want to pick up one of these pieces because they might still be 70% off, which is so nice and affordable, especially for all of you Americans, Mel, <laughs> that are actually coming into summer. And if we get past all this, corona stuff you can actually get out and use your cute new swimsuits so let me know which one was your favorite mine is definitely the sparkly bikini probably followed by the buckle bottoms or the shorts i don't know they're all super cute but thank you so much for watching we really hope you enjoyed it i put out new videos every few days subscribe and hit that notification bell if you'd like to see more and i'll see you next time bye guys